must have been 13 or 14 years old when my dad first took me fly fishing. We used to load up the RV with all the fishing gear and equipment and drive all the way up into the mountains and search for the most pristine water and find the most gorgeous campsites. And my father would get us set up right on the stream and we'd have the greatest time of our life. This was a real big part of my childhood. And then of course, here we are, still taking the trip. The biggest thrill I have is sharing the same experience with Taylor as I did with my father 30 years ago. Tomorrow we're going to be fishing an awesome stretch. The fishing can be just absolutely phenomenal at times. This is one of my favorite places to go. Camping here is beautiful. You're in the pines. Hi. How you doing? Through here. When going fly fishing with my father, Good job, Taylor. We've always enjoyed having the RV on hand. It just makes it such a more pleasurable experience. We get there, we're set up, we're ready to go. We're going to eat outside tonight? You know, we have all the comforts of home right there, and having it ready made just makes it so much less stressful. T bone. Yeah, don't overcook mine. 20 inches. You ready for that? Yep. Oh boy. And this is going to perfectly match the hatch, but make sure it turns out something close like that. My dad, uh, he gave my brother and I each a bamboo fly rod and uh, taught us how to fly fish. And we put the tent up, set up our bunks, and put pots and pans under the bunk because the bears used to come in the tents at night hung the bacon up in a tree and got up early morning and went out and caught two limits of trout and had them cleaned by 8.30. We hit the big river down in the gorge canyon again? Yeah, probably. think about coming back up here next year guys that's a long time next huh? year will you be ready by then what about next weekend yeah it's a tradition we have to come back the fishing is always incredible here and the river is calling us <laughs> 